Hey everybody, welcome back again to the lighthouse. Now, uh, I know it's not every day that we get two videos in a single day, but uh, I thought for the weekend, or well, the end of the weekend, I'd come up with something a little special. So today, we are going to play a, a new game. Uh, new to this channel anyway, it's a very old game. It's called Seek and Destroy for the PlayStation 2 and maybe some other systems, I don't know. I had it on the PS2. And, uh, it's a game about tanks. Just tanks. Nothing but tanks. You don't need to worry about anything else. Okay? Just tanks. So, I hope everyone will enjoy this, because I really like this game. It's very funny. So, I'll see you all in a little bit once we get started. Okay. Well, here's a bit of a. Uh, oh, nope. Bad game. Anyway, so uh, this game is a bit different from your average game. <laughs> it's called Seek and Destroy, and uh, I had this game way back for the PS2, and uh, you know, it's a, it's a game about tanks. Right? Tanks are pretty neat. But, uh... These tanks are a little weird. Stop! Stop trying to play the... Stop! Stop! <laughs> okay. I'm gonna hit the start button. I'm gonna make it... Name entry! Okay. Time to enter in a fantastic and appropriate name. ourselves a tank. Now at this point, you're looking at the game and you're saying, oh, you know, this, um, you know, I don't have any context for the game, but you know, there's some nice looking tanks. You know, they're looking like some uh, World War II tanks. You know, you got yourself a Sherman, a Chiha, a Sumo. This M1542, you got yourself a your Panzer. And, um, yeah, these, these tanks are looking pretty good. Now, what do I want? M3 Stewart? The old classic shirt? Maybe a tank destroyer? Type 97 Chia improved. Well, okay. Start game with this tank. Sure. Also, I'm pretty sure this thing has a machine gun in the back of the turret. So, let's go. Beacon of the counter attack. Yes, this game is a tad different. Like we have some World War II tanks with an aim.
basically, this is, um, is, this is like, uh, cars, you know, sentient vehicles, except it's, uh, war. Lots of fighting and dying. I took a martyr, I think. Anyway, I'm just gonna reverse into town real quick, because we got some money. Revage there's... Anyway, so we got a bunch of non-combat cars. I mean, vehicles driving around. And we got the arena. First, let's go check out the shop. Go see what kind of wackiness we get in this game. By the way, this is a PS2 game. I don't know if it came out for anything else. I'm playing it on an emulator right now. But, let's go check out the shop. What do we got? Buy parts. Main weapon, engine, trap parts, sub-weapon A, sub-weapon B, turret gear, computer, and radar. So yeah, there's a lot of customizability. Okay, so let's see, Super Shell for 1200. Torpedo. <laughs> Can I get the description of this tank shell? The flame spreads when it hits the ground, causing splash damage to other enemies. Cannot use in water. <laughs> More powerful ship has fast speed and able to attack far away objects. So, then we have the Grand Bomb. <laughs> Drops the bomb behind you. Bad news for enemies chasing you. Don't step on it yourself. Then we've got ye old machine gun. Can give little damage, but can open automatic fire for bodyguard tanks with B. Do I have tank with B? Give me machine. Do I have tank with B? Oh wait, no, we got all of those tanks. Hey, I have a tank with B. Most of my tanks have B. <laughs> that would be me. Machine gun. Now where's my where's my machine gun? Okay, it's there. Oh, I have no pockets. other kinds of fun stuff. Sub-weapon B. Another machine gun. Or a missile. Or a chainsaw. Yes, you've heard it here. We can mount a chainsaw on our tank. Attached to the gun. Can attack nearby enemies. Thanks, buddy. The missile shoots missiles. They are homing missiles. I will buy this for most of my money garage to put a giant missile launcher on my tank. Boom. Missile launcher. <laughs> so now we are going to go to drive over to the arena. Oh god, look at that. I have a, I have a missile launcher. <laughs> anyway, the arena is a pretty good way of pretty sure making money and also getting the tank. So let's see, we're fighting a Martyr 3, a Sherman Jumbo, or a Common. Let's see, tank for training feet and field exercises, the normal customized tank. Powerful tank that is customized to suit the feet. Well, let's go off against ye old Martyr 3. Do you want to battle Martyr 3? I, th I think I do. I'm gonna start some. Okay, there's a Aha, there's the missile launcher. Die, boy! Machine gun! Needs a main gun, and you have a machine gun and missiles. Win, player one. <laughs> or win one play. I get 200 money. And I get the Martyr 3. So we can fight each of these boys. Uh, yeah, so let's go into the Jumbo Sherman. The Sherman Jumbo. This guy's medium difficult. So we may have some Okay. Able. Firing those missiles as fast as we can. Looks like that guy's not uh
even wackier. Also, Sherman Jumbo. I might, I might have to switch over to that. That's a nice tank. But now we got a common. Yes, if you expected a normal tank game with seek and destroy, that's not what you're getting. Yes, let's see. This is a game that has tank stealth missions and uh, tank aircraft. take off of me. Oh wait, no. No, 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 no. Get back in there. I forgot to buy parts. Buy parts. Engine. The super duper engine. Travel parts. Can't do. What's this do? Has more power, but still easy to fit. Turret gear. The slow gear. The mid gear. <laughs> oh yeah, you can get some very crazy stuff. Computer. What do you do? Parts for lock-on. Lock-on range. Guided weapons. Radar. Get the small radar. Oh, oh. No, you don't. The mid gear. Good for the ordinary person. Fantastic. Travel. Expert Arena is 
misleading. Those are mini games. Fine. I didn't want them anyway. Aha. Option. No. Status. No. Okay. Wait. Get right. Okay, let's go save real quick. Wouldn't want anything weird to happen and then we lose all of my progress. To the garage. No, not light howls, guy. We want light who's guy. We have traveled 1.4 Q kilometers. One time. Not sure what that means. But I kind of want the, uh, the super shell, so I'm going to go back into the arena a little bit. I'm not going to make you have to watch it, but I am going to go in. Because we got one heck of a band coming up soon. Against, let me see. I think our enemy is called Q-Steam. Houston, something like that.
came just in time. I need to thank Rade's giant. We've news from the patrol. Lieutenant General Amadi is near Tungle. He's transferred to Ascalaza. Okay, we can't miss this. <laughs> Attack the enemy and save him. Please excuse us. Send him my best regards. Auf Panzer T and the Churchill Mark II. Nice. I want. Uh, yeah, by the look, wait. Yeah, by the looks of it, my machine gun is in the hall, so I can't do very much of it. <laughs> but anyway, I think we're gonna wrap up here. Drive back into town so I can save. Because I'm not sure if you can save when you're out and about on the open world. But regardless, we can drive back home. And, uh, yeah. I played this game uh, a pretty good bit. I think I've beaten it once or twice. But, uh, I don't know. It's a dumb game, but I think it's really fun. <laughs> I might play more of this. Probably will, actually. Yeah, I'm definitely playing more of this. Okay, is this just the number of times I've saved? Let me see. Okay, yes. Just the number of times I've saved. <laughs> Alright, well, uh... Yeah, I think we're about done here. Hey, everybody. Welcome to the end of the video. I hope you all enjoyed this first little episode. I know you probably can't hear me very well. Yeah, I forgot to do balancing <laughs> for the audio before I recorded, but I was really excited this morning when I did it, so I kind of screwed up. I didn't want to scrap the episode and start all over, because I didn't think I would, uh, I don't know, be as enthusiastic. So I decided to just keep it, and I'll make sure for the second one, and there isn't a problem, and it will be fixed, so that hopefully you can hear me above uh, above the game and all the cool stuff happening in the game. So, hope everybody enjoyed, and uh, I will see you tomorrow. Bye.